It is with great joy that I inform the Global Academia that Crunch Econometric School launches on the Teachable platform the practical econometrics for researchers, beginners, and advanced level users called PEBA. I will be the sole facilitator for PEBA. My name remains Ngozi Adeleye. I hold a doctorate degree in economics. My interests are in economic and financial modeling and my software proficiency uh, as you can see on the screen. So also are my academic qualifications and I am a Nigerian. I am a data analyst and consultant with over 25 years cognitive experience in banking and academia. I am quantitative inclined, research oriented with publications in high impact journals. My Crunch Econometrics platform is a digital outreach dedicated to teaching hands-on applied econometrics to beginners, intermediate, and advanced level users. My digital platform has become a circle to students and researchers across the globe. At the moment, I have created 144 YouTube video tutorials and at the moment, I also have over 17,000 subscribers. My research interests revolve around issues related to sustainable development goals. I am a reviewer to several international journals. I am a trainer and motivational speaker. I am also an experienced proofreader. You can check out the rest of my profile on the links as shown on the screen. The practical econometrics for researchers, beginners, and advanced level users, which has been launched on the Teachable platform, is a one-stop place for students and researchers. PEBA video tutorials will cover so much that students and researchers will be able to analyze and interpret their results across different analytical techniques. I will be covering videos on CLRM, dummy variables, causality models, limited dependent variable models, co-integration and error correction models, time varying coefficient models, dynamic heterogeneous panels, threshold analysis, quantile and interquantile analysis, distributed lag models, structural equation models, time series modeling and forecasting, duration models, modeling long-run relationships, modeling volatility and correlation, switching and state pace models, traditional panel data models, panel co-integration, difference in difference models, cross-sectional analysis, and so much more. A lot of videos will be um, created on that paper on the Teachable platform. A word of caution, Crunch Econometrics paper is not about solving classroom econometrics exercises, but it is strictly towards engaging and interpreting research tailored analysis. So I am referring to analysis you want to engage in your BSc, MSc, or PhD thesis, particularly your section three and section four, and if you are writing a manuscript, you can be able to um, use any of these techniques to complete both your section 3 and section 4 of your manuscript. Now, let's take a look at um, some nitty-gritty that will be covered in some of these uh, topics. Looking at the CLRM, which is the Classical Linear Regression Models, I'll be looking at simple regressions, multiple regressions, violations of CLRM assumptions, the diagnostic states, and how we can apply this to economic and financial data. What are the expected transformations? I will be able to show you hands-on guide using Stata and eViews, ability to apply knowledge to different data types. You will be able to analyze your manuscript tailored analysis and also independently analyze and interpret your results with the aim of you publishing in high impact journals. So this will be the expected transformation as you um, 
enroll in my school and you pay attention and follow the guide as shown in this video tutorials. Let's take a look at time series econometrics. I'll be covering VAR, structural VAR, ARDL and all its variants, co-integration techniques. We'll be looking at structural equation modeling, causality models, gauge and all its variants. We'll be looking at generalized method of moments, that is GMM, under time series. And we are going to apply all these techniques to economic and financial data sets. Remember, the expected transformations remain the same. Ability to use data and e-views conveniently. Ability to apply this knowledge to your thesis or to your manuscript. And to be able to independently interpret your results with the aim of publishing in high impact journals. Under simultaneous equation models, I'll be covering videos on how uh, the issue of ignoring simultaneity, identification problem, how you can estimate same and apply it to real time uh, data sets. Let's take a look at limited dependent variable models. Quite a lot will be done. We'll be looking at logit, probit, tobit, the truncated models, the ordered probits, and how to apply them to both economic and financial data sets. The expected transformation remains the same as earlier outlined. Duration models. For those of you interested, I'll be covering sensoring, hazard functions, how we can model hazard rates using exponential distribution, using the Weibull distribution, uh, analyzing discrete time duration models, and applying this to real-time data sets. Duration models are very, very interesting. So if you are um, one of those who have um, a niche for duration models, please stick with me, enroll in my school, and let's um, get this done together. How about switching and state space models? Also very interesting topic. I'll be covering modeling seasonality, regime switching models, Markov switching, threshold autoregressive models. We'll be looking at self-exciting threshold autoregressive models. We will also cover the Kalman filter analysis and various angles of the state space, state space models and also apply them to real data sets. This is a very interesting topic for researchers. So you can actually bring out several papers if you understand Markov switching and every other variance that goes with it. Dynamic heterogeneous panel data will also be covered, looking at cross-sectional dependence, panel co-integration, panel unit roots, and the various techniques that we can use. We have the CCE, DCCE, the AMG, the PMG, the PCSC, the FGLS, the DOLS, FMOLS, CU. UPFM and so on and so forth and how we can apply this to real data sets. A lot of papers you can actually generate if you understand how to use any of these techniques. Like I said before, PEBA is going to be a one-stop place for all students and researchers across the globe. We are going to cover so many topics, so many uh, techniques will be displayed on this platform. So many. So you have a lot to learn. Once you can enroll uh, into the Crunch Econometrics PEBA series, there are also uh, added benefits, pegs, and bonuses. Subject to terms and conditions, once you enroll into the Crunch Econometrics PEBA, you are opportune to come into uh, research collaborations with other enrollees. You have access to quality and relevant articles. You have access to data sets and data do files that I will be using uh, in some of these videos. Do not all, but some. You also have access to relevant lecture materials. If you are interested in getting a certificate, you will have access to um, certificates, but conditions actually apply to that. So if you are interested in getting certificate to show your proficiency, we can make that available. Now to roll out, there will be an introductory video, which is free. It's going to be a free watch. And in that video, I'm going to show you how you can import both time series and panel data into e-views and stata. This one looks quite trivial, but I know that so many people do not have idea on how to import their data 
into Stata and eViews. So I'm going to make uh, simple videos uh, to show uh, researchers and students on how to do this. Then I'm going to make videos on limited dependent variable models. And I'm going to cover the linear probability model in detail, looking at estimations and interpretations. So this will be free for everyone so that you can actually understand the quality that will be brought into Crunch Econometrics paper. For access to more interesting video tutorials, I will encourage you to register into Crunch Econometrics School with a one-off payment of $250. It's one-off. It does not require subscription and renewal. One-time payment and is a lifetime payment of $250 gives you access to all the videos that will be displayed in Crunch Echometrics paper. If I'm going to roll out 100 videos or 200 videos or 300 videos, your one-time payments gives you access to watch all the videos that will be on this Teachable platform. You can also be an affiliate if you are interested so that you can earn between 5% to 20% for referrals into the paper course. So if you're able to refer people into my school, you are going to earn as high as 20% and as low as 5% depending on the number of your referrals. And if you also have um, institutions that need to enroll in bulk, discounts are available for bulk institutional enrollment. So you also have a benefit if you can partner with Crunch Econometrics Payback. Thank you once again. I will be your tutor throughout the Crunch Econometrics paper series. I remain Ngozi Adeleye. Thank you and stay safe.